To begin, access the shipping options page via the settings menu. We must first select our shipping origin and allowed countries before creating shipping methods. The shipping origin is used to calculate shipping prices during the checkout. This tells the shipping company the distance for the package to travel. A full list of countries can be selected as your allowed destinations. Simply select a country from the left column and add to the right. Only customers shipping to countries in the selected column will be able to check out. In this way, you can limit countries who can order from your store. You can create both domestic and international methods, and within each, you can create both real-time and custom methods. Let's start with domestic real-time. Real-time shipping methods are pre-installed shipping company calculations, generally reading directly from their database. It's perfect for the standard user, being quick and easy. Unfortunately this may not suit advanced users since the calculations and text are not editable if you have custom rates. If you have the business to business module activated, you may activate this method only for business to business, business to consumer or all. Perfect if your rates differ for wholesale customers. Free shipping over a value can be activated by ticking this box and setting a minimum value to give free shipping over. Additional methods can be added by ticking their boxes. And save. Custom shipping allows you to create your own calculations down to a state-based level. The title will display to customers during the checkout for selection. The description appears next to the title and is generally used for time indications or any special instructions. The shipping company's tracking URL will be included on the shipped confirmation email. Custom methods can also be delivered to business to business or business to consumer customers. There are four types of shipping calculations. A flat fee, by basket value, by basket weight and cost on delivery. Each selection will change the options displayed. For domestic calculations, all available states will be listed in this left column. When selected, they will move to the right column groups. Since we're using weight-based calculations for our example, we need to enter the starting weight value of the combined products in this order. This would generally start at zero. We then enter the maximum weight value for this first shipping cost range. And now the shipping cost for this weight range, for example $5. We continue to add weight ranges until we reach the maximum weight that we believe would be in any customer's basket. Since different states and countries would naturally have different costs for the same weight ranges, you can create different groups as seen here and save. I'll also show you how to set up free shipping over a weight or basket value using custom shipping. First we set the minimum value to start the free shipping at. And now add the maximum value we expect to be in any customer's order. For example $10,000. And finally we simply add the cost for this range to be zero dollars. And save. 
International shipping setup is the same as for domestic, the main differences are the real-time shipping options you can select. For international custom shipping, you will need to select countries into groups, just as you have for states in domestic settings. And then your variables. Then continue to add more groups for countries you allow shipment to. And then save. Click the, New Shipping, button to add as many methods as you wish. To save time, you can also clone an existing custom shipping method via this button. and save.